hey guys welcome back to my channel in today's video i will be testing the eyeshadow palette from beauty bay in collab with nikki tutorials so if you want to see how i created this makeup makeup look and also my opinion about the eyeshadow palette then keep on watching so this is how the eyeshadow palette looks like it's absolutely gorgeous it's quite thick as you can see guys and um, this is how it opens so absolutely gorgeous colors as you can see the Nikki designed it it has a total number of 20 shades it has eight shimmers and the rest are matte I managed to tap my finger in this and almost destroy this color also I'm gonna do some swatches so you can see guys how this actually looks like I'm gonna start with the first row First one is Redemption, by the way, really creamy and pretty pigmented as you can see. Then we have Blend and Snap, it's a really nice pink and again pigmented. Then we have a shimmer and it's called Ivy. Yeah, absolutely beautiful. Um, it's a bit powdery but it looks nice. Then we have Slasher. One of my favorite colors, more like a um, burgundy type of purple. And then the last one from this uh, row is 5 a.m. and it's a deep brown. Really nice color. Okay, the second row, first shade Roxy Catan, pink, and it's it looks like a dual chrome. And by the way, it swatch beautifully. Next we have VLA. Then we have Mikai. Apparently she named this color after her brother that unfortunately passed away and is really pigmented and a gorgeous red. Then we have Mila, again swatched gorgeous. And the last shade from this row is Underground, gorgeous. I think I'm gonna use this shade actually, it's absolutely beautiful, look, gorgeous. Okay, moving on to the next row. We have Plotty Twist, it is a really pale blue, like a sky blue type. Then we have Aura, again gorgeous swatch as you can see, I love it. Then we have Basic Truth, it is a really light nude. Then we have All In, very pigmented and is a dual chrome. Last one from this row, it's called Ew, and it's a green. As far as I know, she hates green, so probably that's why she, she named this shade Ew. I don't know. And the last row, we have Pride, and I think this is her favorite color, and it's a gorgeous color again, a dual chrome, lovely swatch. Then we have Zoma, a matte peach. Zoma Tutorials, this is named. I think after her mom or something again gorgeous swatch is a really lovely shimmer blue Amsterdam last but not least we have mr. tutorials apparently she chose this shade after her fiance color eye color or something so apparently he has this eye color but it's a gorgeous color anyway so yeah so yeah there are so many colors in here actually I have no idea which I want to try because I like a lot of them but I will definitely try some shimmers as well and some mattes so stay tuned okay so as you can see I already pried my eyes as I always do and I think I'm gonna start in my outer corner with the shade Amsterdam so this gorgeous blue is pigmented Okay, I know it looks like a mess now, but trust the process. And in this bit, I am gonna use the shade All In, so this one in here. Oh yeah. Dual chrome, and I love it. 
And I will blend with this blue. It does build up beautiful. Now I'm going back in that blue that I used called Amsterdam. So I need to blend this up. And in my brow bone, I'm going to use Plot Twist, so this really pale blue. I'm taking a, a bigger brush now and I'm blending these two blue together. So I'm dipping in the Plot Twist, twist again. Now I'm going back into the shade Amsterdam in my outer V. Okay, and on my lower lash line, I think I'm going to use the shade 5pm, so this brown in here. Okay, it looks pretty crazy right now but after I will just finish the rest of my face and add some lashes everything will come together so yep yeah, I will see you right back Okay, so now let's talk about this eyeshadow palette. I actually have some mixed thoughts. I was thinking that I would love it. I was so excited to try it. And I was like, you know what? It's not gonna go wrong. Because the is Beauty Bay. But to be honest, a few of these shadows that I actually tried. Not only that they were extremely powdery, which usually is not with the Beauty Bay palette. They are powdery, but not this extremely powdery. Uh, a few of them that I swatched seemed a bit patchy, but I haven't tried them on my eyelids just Because um, I can't I mean there's so many but um, I do like that they are pigmented as you can see especially the So yeah, the shimmers are really pigmented, but they are too chunky too glittery anyway the one that I actually tried in most of them I think the only one that is not extremely pigment uh, I mean sorry extremely chunky it's pride this one in here um, it feels really creamy on touch but the one I use the all-in is so glittery I mean it's all over my shirt I can't take it off it was all over my face so yeah it even entered in my eyes uh, they are on my eyelashes so I don't know these are actually behaving like glitters so if you want to do your eye look, just keep this in mind. Do your eyes first and then do your base. The mattes are pigmented. The color story is really beautiful. I mean, I do want to try more. Um, and I didn't expect that the plot twist, so this one, it feels like a pastel type of color that it's not extremely pigmented. So I don't know. I could say I can give this palette a 7 out of 10. Because, I don't know, the ones that I tried, I will give it another chance. But the one that I've tried, um, I don't know, it was a bit 
disappointed. I mean, with the actual shimmer, I was disappointed because the map, the Amsterdam color actually blend out beautifully. As you can see, I didn't have any issues with that. But the shimmer that I used, it was so chunky and glittery. It did build up, but I had a wet base underneath. So usually it should build up. Um, yeah, as I said, I have mixed thoughts. I'm gonna try this more in the future. These are my thoughts about this eyeshadow palette. Just uh, tell me guys if you tried this eyeshadow palette before and how it worked for you. Um, did you feel disappointed as well? Or I don't know, am I doing something wrong? I'm not blending how I should. I mean, I did use my finger, so I didn't use like a, a brush or anything. Let me know in the comments down below if you tried this eyeshadow palette and how it actually worked for yourself. Thank you very much for watching. Um, if you're new, please don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell for more videos like this every week. Also, if you like this video, please give it a big thumbs up. It will mean a lot for me. Thank you very much for watching guys and I will see you next time. Bye!